Special thanks to John for sending us examples and giving us permission to share his early and late work so you can get a better idea of how the graphic design and new media programs help students grow. John completed both the graphic design and new media degrees, giving him the skills to work as a hybrid designer. Increasingly, employers want designers with print, web design and development, and multimedia digital content creation skills. John struggled in high school, but he knew he wanted to be a designer for a living. Clark State helped to make that possible for John. Currently, 100% of Clark State graduates who complete both the graphic design and new media degrees have been employed in the field of digital media. In this example early in the graphic design program, you can see John is struggling to fully execute his ideas and put together a layout. The illustration is underdeveloped and needs some work. There is a poor hierarchy to the text and multiple typefaces used that are not working well together. In this example, we again see an inconsistent illustration style, a poor hierarchy to the text, and typeface approaches that are not working together. Items are crowded on the page and not framed well with space. In this example from early in the program, you can see John is developing in his creativity but there are still some issues with his use and arrangement of type. Much of his original typeface is difficult to read, and the details of the event are poorly arranged with some problems with punctuation and spacing. John continued to grow steadily through the program and develop his skills. After learning at Clark State the elements and principles of design, along with how to use the software, John was able to better unleash his creativity and think of type not merely as an afterthought, but as an artistic way to execute his designs. In this example of work done for an actual client, we see John has learned how to better arrange type on the page and how to frame it with space. He also has learned critical brand design skills that helped him to execute this logo design for a client during Clark State's Service Learning Capstone course. 100% of our graphic design students work with actual clients before graduation. In this final graphic design example, we see John has learned the importance of the marriage between image and type. The hierarchy of the type is much stronger and better leads the eye around the page. He is also able to do dynamic things with the type while still maintaining readability. But John didn't stop there. After completing his Associate of Applied Business in Graphic Design, he took advantage of an option at Clark State to complete the new media program. With the general education and basic courses overlapping in both degrees, a student only needs to complete the technical courses to obtain a second Associate of Applied Business degree. John wanted to build on his graphic design skills and complete the new media degree to learn web design and development and multimedia design skills in an effort to make himself more marketable. The first example shows some of John's early work with motion graphics. You can tell he is struggling with the animation of the type so that it all flows together and enhances the message he is trying to send. It is also only using very basic animation techniques. In this example from late in the program, John has gotten much better at working with animation. He has developed skills with masks and easing to make the animation flow well with the imagery around it. As you can see in the title and lower third graphics, he has also learned to layer multiple mask animations together to optimize motion graphics. John's skill with video and motion graphics that he developed during the new media program resulted in John being paid to do work for the Springfield Symphony Orchestra. And he created the animation for the explainer video detailing Clark State's new media web design certificate. John also grew considerably in the area of web design and development. In this website example from the HTML and CSS course early in John's graphic design studies, you can see that John is struggling in the area of web design. He is also not taking into account user experience or content strategy, which has weakened his design. Breaking completely from standards and conventions has made his site confusing. He has used textures and patterns that make his design busy and the use of type is not working. In this next website example produced during the New Media Capstone course for an actual client, here is the original site before John's work on the redesign. Here is John's redesign of the site. You can see John has greatly improved his web design skills. 
Here he has developed a custom theme for a WordPress site so the client can easily manage the content. And he has made the design responsive so it displays well on desktop computers as well as tablets and mobile devices. After using his graphic design skills to design a new logo for transitions, counseling, and wellness, John also created the website for the company. He used positive and negative space well and has continued to develop his skills working with the grid to arrange content and make it easy to access. Again, John has created a responsive design that will display well on desktop and mobile. You can see in John's evolution of his own portfolio website design how his skills as a web designer and developer grew over time through his coursework at Clark State. Because of the graphic design, web design and development, and multimedia skills John learned in the graphic design and new media programs, he was hired part-time by a print, web development, and multimedia marketing firm while finishing his studies at Clark State, with the promise that he would be moved to full-time upon graduation. In these additional responsive web design samples, you can see that John continued to expand his knowledge and skills with web design in his continued work for actual clients. John graduated with an Associate of Applied Business and New Media from Clark State and was hired full-time at Think Patented in Dayton, the same firm that allowed him to work part-time while he finished his studies at Clark State. You can see in the before and after example shown in this video the critical skills John learned in both the graphic design and new media programs at Clark State that prepared him for the field. Thank you again to John for allowing us to show his work and showcase how he has grown through the program. His work continues to impress us, and we are very proud of him. To find out more about graphic design and new media at Clark State Community College, please visit www.clarkstate.edu.